Welcome. I'm delighted to join you here on numerologist.com. Hi, I'm Julie Geigel, International Psychic Medium and Spiritual Healer over at HeavenSentHealing.us. And I'm here today to share with you a beautiful chakra healing forecast. Alrighty, so the card that I drew today for the chakra healing is impartiality. Yeah, and the seventh chakra. So this week we are focusing on clearing and releasing any blockages to that seventh chakra. And the color of the seventh chakra, the auric color is white. I always think of it in terms of white. Um, but typically that seventh chakra is violet. And it's the crown of your head and it's the element of thought and it is your connection with the divine. And so you might notice that this chakra is blocked if you're feeling depressed or maybe you're having a lot of headaches or brain fog. Now, here's some quick, uh, simple things you can do to help clear out that chakra and keep it spinning freely. So meditate. Absolutely, because it is the um, connection with the divine. The chakra helps you deepen and strengthen your connection with the divine. So make sure you're meditating regularly. Five minutes, literally. Focus on your breath for five minutes. And silence. So this week is all about silence. You know, reading books, doing puzzles, uh, but not about engaging or big long conversations with your mother. No, this week is about silence. It's about retreating, kind of um, being impartial, neutral, if you will. So any activity that encourages that uh, energy is perfect for helping to rebalance the chakra center. Now you're going to want to grab your lavender oil, or your frankincense oil. And the crystals that we're looking at um, for this week are quartz and amethyst for healing. And this chakra is not about food. So typically we're like, you know, eat the color, right? Um, but not with this chakra. This chakra is about fasting and detoxing. So it's the perfect time if you've been looking at a cleanse or or eating healthy for you know a three days or five day run this is perfect that will bring you back into alignment all right now our question for the week is if i take a step back um, to gain some perspective on this situation what do I see? And is it possible for me to remain neutral, to be impartial? So I really want you to let this uh, situation, the problem, whatever it is that um, you're experiencing, I want you to let it unfold naturally. I think of it as organically. And I'm not seeing a lot of action this week for you. There's nothing that you need to do. It is about taking a step back, trying to see all of the different perspectives, trying to see everybody's side, putting yourself in the other person's shoes, and really opening your mind to another way of thinking and getting different perspectives on what exactly is happening. And so it's really important not to take sides, even though there might be a clear winner and loser here. Do not jump in and take sides. Do not um, fight for anyone. <laughs> right now, button the lip, <laughs> keep your mouth closed. I know it's hard to do sometimes, but just shine your light. That's, that's the good that you can do this week is shine your light. And be a silent witness. Sometimes holding that space is just as important as getting in and fixing it. And um, this week you also might find yourself being pulled 
to mentor or guide someone. So someone might be looking at you for some wisdom or advice. And again, it's not about fixing anything. It's really about helping that person hear themselves out. We know we've all had a friend where, you know, after we pour our hearts out, we know instantly what to do, and she didn't even say anything. Uh, so that's the space that you're being invited to hold for someone this week. Don't try to fix them, just um, be their sounding board. Perfect. And remember, uh, what you don't say is more important this week than what you do say. That's a big one. All right, everyone, um, that's all I have for you here today. We'd love to hear from you. Drop us a comment below. What, think about that question. If I take a step back, um, what do I see? Can I gain a different perspective? Or am I able to stay neutral or impartial in this situation? We'd love to hear more about your story, your issues. How can we help you? Drop that in the comments below. And if you haven't subscribed to us over on numerologist.com on YouTube, make sure you hit that subscribe button. You'll be notified as soon as my forecast goes live. All right, everyone, have a beautiful and blessed day. Mwah!